I think wellness to me means having a balanced kind of mind, body, and spirit. It's always a struggle trying to balance those three elements, but I mean, if you can, then you can be a lot happier and feel like more of a complete person. My name's Ryan Atkins, and I'm an obstacle course racer. I've done sports and athletics my whole life, and in high school that involved, you know, wrestling and football and rugby, and then from there, mountain biking, running, and then I tried obstacle course racing, and it was just a natural, great fit. So I've got a wonderful Alaskan Malamute named Sunto, who uh, comes with me on a lot of my runs, and, you know, he comes fat biking, skiing, whatever I'm doing, he'll tag along. We train together all year round, so it's awesome. Going to the gym is definitely a key component to my training, and a lot of my workouts will be kind of circuit training with a focus on more like functional movements and not as much focus on heavy lifting. And I find that that really helps with injury prevention and, you know, all round strength. If I have the option, I'd much rather train outside. I can, you can kind of incorporate a lot of different activities done in nature. I really like to rock climb. You can become really strong and have really good kind of core strength. You know, doing things like chopping wood for a few hours, like it all kind of plays in to training. It's just more beautiful and more inspiring to do those things outside. A place like Scandinavia would fit into my routine in, you know, maybe once a week. When I go to the baths, I like starting with the warm bath at first and spending, you know, 10 or 15 minutes in there and then doing a few immersions in the cold water for maybe, you know, 30 seconds and then back to the warm. And I find that kind of really boosts your kind of immune system and kind of gets your whole system really fired up. And then uh, spending some time in the sauna and in the uh, steam room is just a really nice way to kind of cap it off. Balance is really important and as someone whose life kind of revolves around trying to be faster and trying to be more fit and train, it's sometimes easy to have that kind of escape you and slip away. Making time for activities that don't involve being super active is really important and I think a key to your mental state. I think that the more you can employ a place like Scandinav in order to supplement your training and kind of offset the intensity is a really useful tool and yeah, a really great addition into your arsenal of training techniques.